This is just a quick demonstration video for one of our YouTube users, House Nebula, who was just asking some questions about converting a, um, a, uh, a line or a, or a rectangle into a pad or pin in Jeddah. So for instance, if you're doing like a dissipation pad, you might draw it with a rectangle like that. And then a couple of uh, surface mount pins, just draw those with lines. So I'm drawing this all on the component layer. If I just press S, make these a little bit bigger. And you can uh, also draw things on the silk screen layer as well. That will be included in this element. So you could use um, like lines or arcs and draw around the outside. I'm just going to do a simple box. Okay. So if we go back to this component layer and select everything, everything that you want to be in the footprint, and then go to select in the menu and convert selection to element. And this will grey the window out and you have to select uh, a kind of orientation point. So just pick this bottom left pin here. And now that should be converted to an element. So if we go to the layers here you can see that pads and pins everything on that layer and you can see the boxes on the silk screen layer. So if we just pull up another component here we'll be able to test it and see if we can connect some tracks up. So just pop a resistor in there. Maybe just copy the component again and pop it down there. I'm just going to use a line here, connect a few tracks up. So Jeddah kind of um, it names all the pins for you. It's normally pin 1, pin 2 and pin 3 as standard. Yep, so these all seem to work fine. And you can see that the, the pads and pins are no longer on the component layer, just the tracks. And hopefully that should give you an idea of, uh, of how to do that. If you just uh, want to leave any more comments or any more questions, just go ahead and I'll, I'll see if I can help you out. Cheers.